also want to do another VR chat stream at some point. Because the last time I did it, which was the only time I did it, um, I was still kind of new to VR chat. But now I've got a bunch of worlds saved that I could show and stuff, and it'll be fun. What's that? A lever? I'm not ready for more enemies yet. Hang on. Oh, piss off. I've got a grenade launcher. Ugh. Fell down a hole when I was trying to get to the health. Okay, I think we're safe for now. Tried blood maps of Z Doom. Fancy but unstable. Hmm. I guess there's only so much that you can do without going into massive modding. Less fat and more muscle. As in the the creature that I've forgotten which creature I even mentioned. Gosh. It's hard to have a memory. Might as well just stick with use then, maybe. Or something. That never happened to you. Wait, what didn't? Oh, like dropping your weapons and stuff. Maybe. I was still kind of new to VR. That, that was like one of the first things I tried when I got VR. So I guess I was probably a bit of a plonker then. I know you kind of... you, you put your axe on your hip, don't you, to kind of sheath it. Oh, that would have been nice. I guess you can even do Doom VR in like Megawads as well. You can play all of the custom Doom stuff in VR. You can go through all of Maximum Doom for full immersion. As soon as I finish doing Maximum Doom, I'm going to redo all of them in VR and re-record all of them. Whoa. Oh. No. 3am VR chat stream. Yeah, that was fun. The audio balancing was a bit weird. I've also got better avatars for it now as well. Back then I was using some base kobold avatar, but I've got a better kobold avatar now. And a possum that I customised today and I'm looking forward to trying later. Hopefully it exported properly because Unity was being a little bit of a twat, begging me to update it from the 2019 version. New 2D Prince of Persia, oh yeah. Yeah, Ubi. Ubi hard. No, they don't make me hard. And um, the Lost Crown. And look, maybe that's the one you're talking about. But yeah, it's on Steam now, I guess, or coming to Steam. So that was good news. Even if you still have to use Ubisoft, whatever. Connect, or whatever it's called these days. Stand on a small pillow. I guess that makes sense. So you kind of know where you are a little bit better. Because in VR I often find myself turned around and wondering how I got there. But yeah, I've got like no space in my room. I have to be facing a certain direction where I've got enough space in front of me. But I basically can't move from that spot because I'm going to walk into something. Tiny room. Did it release already? I don't know if it released already on Ubisoft's thing, or if it's, like, coming out now everywhere. But I played the demo and it was very good. So I'll probably get it either way, even if I have to use Ubisoft's thing. Oh yeah, Wadsmoosh, that was the name. I was trying to remember that earlier. I guess it's like that, but in a more official capacity. Replay Dark Souls VR. I'm not surprised that's a thing. 
Hydrakia, Infromusias, he would like to offer you the única chance to revive your mind news the Boris game. Star Wars. As a big influencer, he would also like to offer you a free trip to Disneyland. Uh, yes, please. Whose dick would I like to touch in Disneyland? Are there any sexy characters in Disney movies? I guess the beast from Beauty and the Beast is okay, but not the best. There's probably some lizards, but I can't think of off the top of my head. Thanks, Zack. I'd love to go there and review the Star Wars. Imagine Drake actually playing games in VR. I don't have the space, otherwise I'd love to. Every time I've tried, I destroy something. Never actually destroyed something, but I hit things. I don't want to destroy the TV. Riven in VR, that would be fun. I don't think there is a remake of that, though. I could show you the Mist VR remake world, though, thing. And we can all laugh at the voiced sound effects. For some reason, when you pull a lever, it goes like chong! With a voice. Tiny British houses. This one's tiny, anyway. I would have had more space in the previous house before we moved to the tiny island. Not goofy, I don't want to touch him. He's too goofy for me. Yeah, I don't I don't really need a TV, I don't use it. It's hooked up to the PS4, but I never use that. Last time I used it was probably for the East 8 stream. Maybe. Did I stream anything since then? Wait, no. Doom Eternal was after that, wasn't it? This probably opens nearby. Oh. This is very familiar. I've been thinking this whole map seems familiar, but now I especially feel like it. Maybe I've played like a like standalone version of this map. Yeah, do it. Oh, I will then. There'll probably just be random ones rather than on the like actual stream days then. Where are you? Yeah, because I remember having trouble seeing these on their little shelves. But I've done it. But yeah, lots of worlds I can show off. You can now return... I can now return to my slumber. I wish I could. But no, I've got a stream for these chumps. No! Missed the Drax friends. Friends? What are they? Imagine having friends in current year. No, you all are. Smooch. That was the fiend, not you. Oh, you can have a smooch as well. A big sloppy dragon smooch. I'll have to dig my way up. Survive three grenades. All right, where are we going now? I can return to my slumber. Apparently, I don't remember where my slumber was. I stood around talking for half an hour and forgot everything. Wait, what? Doom three free on Steam? Oh, that's nice. I don't remember what they did with Doom 3, like when BFG Edition came out, they I think they took original Doom 3 off, but then it went back up at some point. Yeah, that's nice of them. Good. A good time to do a Doom 3 replay. That should be happening once I'm done with Elden Ring. TV, PS5 and PSVR 2 headset. 
Last time I used them was months ago. Oh, I guess you have a different headset for Doom and stuff. Yeah, I, I guess PSVR is more like limited to PlayStation, isn't it? Plum. A goo early HD TV. That's always good. Always good to have a backup monitor. This one's been around for ages. I'm wondering when this one's going to die. I've had this one for I don't even know how long. Since before I got this PC. All your consoles can fill the slot in. I wish I could have my slot filled in. Help me to sort out the new furniture in your room. Plenty of room for VR, good. Then we can hang out in VR together. I don't know, it would be weird because you won't be a furry. And I will be. Maybe we could... Yum. Yum! Maybe we could meet at some point though. In VR. And again, you don't need a headset to do VR chat. Find it here in one of the rooms. Keeping it. Good. Steal it. Friends in this economy, yeah, they're too expensive. Imagine having a wife. Having a husband is probably more likely. They're easier to find in the gaming world. Not that women don't play games. There's just obviously less of them. There's probably still lots though. Seems to have all the individual ones. That's good. Oh, master levels as well. What about Sigil 2? Tasty, a nice collection. Need a Bethesda account. Gross. Don't take your word for it. Oh, what was this about? Ah, yeah. Well, even if it's not free, it's worth buying Doom 3. I'll have that slurp now. Hmm. Hmm. You get vanilla and BFG. Good. Good boys. Never get rid of original Doom 3. It's the best version still. Isn't this where I came from? There's some squelching. It's rather juicy. Oh, it's him. I don't like this guy. He takes forever sometimes. Maybe it's a weaker version of Katers. What the hell? There's two sets of doors. Before my rest, I can search some more. I'd rather not. Ah, off to bed. I die again. We don't get Doom 1 and 2 for 3, though. For 3? For 3, though. Hmm. I guess they're too beloved. They can still make money off it. You'll just be fat. There's probably plenty of fat avatars. I can take you to an avatar search world. There's even a random button, which is always exciting. You can press the random button and it will put you in a random avatar. You could get horrors beyond your wildest imagination. Or you could get a sausage with legs. If we sat opposite each other at a table and ate food in the McDonald's in VR, there's Brutalist McDonald's, which is apparently a popular world for some reason. I've been there, but I don't really like it much. But I'm not really into Brutalist. I guess I'll have to go there to show Reptiloid though. The Brutalist, brutalist Fetishist. A brutal file. He can judge its brutalism levels if it's good or not. Candles of the Damned by Comrade Beep. Beep! A decently nice collection. Oh, I bet you do. It's probably massive by now. Probably got a hoard of cards that you lay on every night. Cozy 80s arcade world, it certainly does. There's also a nice world that I like going to just for the vibes where it's got like a blockbusters. You can just look at the shelves and read the the spines of the VHS cases. Um that's got an arcade in it as well. I don't think you can play any of the arcades in that specific world, but you can watch little 
animations of Street Fighter and stuff, and it's got some adverts and magazines. Not as interactive as I'd like, but it's it's fun to wander around. But yeah, there's lots of 80s style arcade worlds with the the weird patterned carpets and everything. Turbo Turkey Puncher Cabinet. I wonder if that exists anywhere in VR chat. It better do. I want one of those in real life. May not need to be close in real world. Having meetups in VR. Okay, it'll be comfy, yeah. Maybe we should someday. Everybody install VR chat. You can just use the desktop version. Only if you want to, though. Good avatar would be fun, yeah. Lots of avatars. Eh. Too much to read. I'm sorry. Sometimes I have to decide, should I read everything and delay the gameplay? Or should I just glance over and read some of them? And the people whose messages I miss will have to cry themselves to sleep at night. Modern fast food outlets. All the grey they have now. I remember when McDonald's used to be like red and yellow and colourful and fun. It's really hoping for a mouse look support. Hmm. That's alright, GZ Doom is the way to go. You have to put up with no mouse look if you want the achievements. That's a point, achievements. Are the achievements there as well? Caked in dust. Oh, I didn't know you had... Oh yeah, of course I knew you had one already. You've played Doom 3 and stuff, and VFR. Only about 700. Only? You could build a house out of that. You do need more, though. That fuck all room. That is the problem. Also, Dig Brutalist. I don't know why I don't like it. I guess just, yeah, because it's, like, depressing and stuff. I prefer being happy. I don't know what's wrong with all of you. Maybe you're all too happy already, so you need some depression. Artificial depression. Chris Holden's Axe. Who? That sounds like a familiar name. Uh, Re-releasing the Pixel Remasters physically. Oh, good. I love that the Pixel Remasters exist. Ow! Also, thanks to Zach, we, we can expect more Final Fantasy streams next year, probably. It's going to be fun going through the Pixel Remasters, seeing all the... Uh, additions they've made, and presumably they will have an arranged soundtrack as well, which will be fun. Legacy of Rust, what is that? I don't know if I've heard of Legacy of Rust, is that another Quake mod or, or Doom or something? VR cinemas, yeah, that's fun. It's fun to just sit and chat and watch random shite. VR chat's just cosy, but sometimes it's a reminder of like, why am I here when I could go outside instead and look at the real sky? Oh wait, because I don't have friends in real life. That's why. It's both nice and it's a little bit sad sometimes. I think you put up with playing the whole thing without vertical mouse look. I guess that makes sense if if you didn't play it growing up, did you? I think, you know, you said you got into PC gaming quite late, didn't you? Rewatching Oblivion in VR chat. You can if you want. I would just be uncomfortable sitting in a corner. Uncomfortable hearing all my old commentary. Free look wasn't a thing. Yeah. It would be weird to add it to an official thing. But it is nice to have options, yeah. But yeah, at least we got the source pause, but it would be would have been nice to have it for the achievements. I'll probably go for the achievements anyway, because I, I don't mind the lack of proper mouse look. At the same time. MBF twenty one. Oh. No, mouse look stuff I guess. But yeah, when I when I replayed through Doom 1 and 2, when the BFG edition came out, I was expecting not to get along get along with it very well after getting used to proper mouse look. 
but it was surprisingly comfortable still. Though that might just be because I've I've been used to that for like my life anyway, having grown up with it and everything. But I suppose in a way it would be weird to add it officially because it, it would kind of be like cheating in a way. like a, a remix of E1M2. Yoda's nail gun. Oh, thanks Yoda. That's the kind of force I want. Now that I mention the force, I kind of of in the mood to try playing a Star Wars game, which is very rare for me. I don't generally like the, I guess, the atmosphere and feeling and stuff of Star Wars games. But lately I've been in weirdly a, a mood to play pretty much everything. I briefly tried Flat Out 3 recently and it made me kind of want to stream that. I just want to stream everything. Never used mouse look either. It's time to change. Become the gamer you were meant to be. And look up. That is one nice thing about Doom not having proper mouse look though. In Quake they can hide buttons on the ceiling and you never find them because gamers don't look up. But not in Doom. In Doom the secrets are easy to find because you can't look up or down. Hearing my younger self screaming, Fraps! Monster mod! I mean, Monster mod! That's young Drakaya. Oh yeah, chipmunk powers. A long lost thing, now we do variety videos if there's too many short ones. Much better usage of time. Video time. New source by adding in new things like boom, 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 and stuff. Would have been a nice addition. Yeah. At least there's always options for for people who do want them. Wait, what is Legacy of Rust? Did somebody answer? Did I miss it? Probably. I missed the important answer I was waiting for. Maps are built with it in mind. Yeah, there is that too. There's some levels, especially in like, I guess Final Doom. There's one specific map that I remember. It was like some kind of weird mansion thing. I think it was in Plutonia. Or like there's a room full of revenants that's down a bit far, so oh, you're trying to shoot them but your rockets just hit the floor more than anything, and anything else you might be shooting. Those situations it can be a pain in the ass. But thank Fudge for source ports, so we can play it the way we want to. Uh, some name something. Delight. Jigalag. Isn't that the guy from Shivering Isles? Good old Oblivion. Tasty Oblivion Extras. Word. New music remixes. Battle of Yavin. Doesn't sound familiar. Scroll up a little bit just in case I missed it again. Kotor, maybe. That's one I would like to try someday. That's the Bioware one, isn't it? So that would be a, a big undertaking. My nail gun you obtained. Mm. I can't do Yoda. What was that? Goblin. But um, I guess mostly I was thinking of like... The uh, Jedi Academy and that kind of stuff. The third person ones. Stream all my gaming sessions. That's what I'd like to do. Yep. Yep. 
which would mean I never stream again because I don't play games. But yeah, if I could if I could stream every day instead of having other things I want to do, I would get through even more games. Four copies of the Pixel Remasters, mega fan. The biggest Final Fantasy fan. Master level. I don't think it was a master level, the one I'm thinking of. Because the, the level I'm thinking of I've played more than once. I've only played master levels once. All the way through anyway. I have no desire to replay those. Rogue Squadron. That was like a space flight one, wasn't it? Space combat. Freeware fan project. For Doom, I guess. Hmm. Maybe it's a popular one if the name is coming up. I'll have to try and remember to look into it. Republic Commando. I don't know enough of them. You want a voice, Redeem? I can't do a... I mean, do a Yoda voice, I can't. Not good enough that I could add a Redeem to it for it anyway. Mm! Ah, bye. Where am I? I fell into darkness. Where am I? Did I clip through the level somehow? What happened? I'm through the stairs. Wait, what? Oblivion has claimed me. I need to get there so I can figure out what just happened. And if you use source, source support support, full free look. Those are the only ones I'm gonna play. Feature sets themselves. The feature sets themselves. Oh, I already move us a long way from a villain. There's a baby crying, it's like Dead Space all over again. Dead Space 2 specifically. Bethesda chat mods timing out anyone criticizing Marty Stratton, bloody hell. Wherever you go, there's always shite in the community. Especially from the devs for some reason. So what happened here? Imagine being held accountable. Because they sure can't imagine it. Glop, glop. Yum. Yum. I'm so mind flooded. Mm. Mm. Uh, can pull out a good Yoda with a bit of practice, maybe. <laughs> Play quick. Playing quick, I am. No, I don't know what that is. Fall into darkness. Oh yes. Well, her mouth is open. Thanks for the big darkness. Do do fuck to him, Gordon. Yeah. But he's still there, and probably hasn't been punished at all. They probably blame Mick Gordon. Maybe. I don't even remember what the whole story was. I've forgotten. All I remember is they didn't pay him for the work he did, and used the work anyway. I'll see you later, Muff Geb. Sleep well. Mm. Sexy noises. Right, where am I? I'm back here. Okay, I guess I'll explore the water fully since that's an optional path. And stuff. Fish. As above, so below for Bowel. Oh, is this place? As above, so below, the level from dusk. Wasn't that the one where you flip gravity and stuff? Oh, this is here. What do you mean, blech? Bleg. Bleg. 
I want that. Or do I? Maybe not. Ow. I mean, whoa. Let's go <clears throat> to the Silver Realm. Favorite game, Fallout 76. Oh, yes. Dream of that. Let's just make it his wish. No, I'm not actually going to touch it. I would actually have to be play played. Played like a damn fiddle. A secret area. I got armor. I guess I would, pl I would play it if I had it. I might try it once, but it's not a game I intend to get at any point. Ugh. Ugh. I also don't particularly desire it. I love how big the enemies' hitboxes are in Quake. So cheesable sometimes. They overcompensated for some of the bad hitboxes in Doom, where the top half of Revenants don't exist. Hello? Okay. Oh, Morpha's bag of treats. Kobold has Treeto. A kobold's toes are quite a treat. No. Probably got treats stuck between them if you like grime. Sorry. Fall to a quick map pack called Seismic Ventures. Delightfully vanilla. Okay, now I'm excited as well. Although I do prefer. Arcane Dimensions weapons, because it turns hit scan into projectiles, which I, I love because I hate hit scan, but the more Quake the better. I'm glad the Quake community is still like active and stuff. It's not all Doom all the time. It's software, truly the best FPS makers of their time. As proven by the community still playing them and making for them. Oh my god! Recycled ideas, here comes a fiend! Ah. Thanks, Beep, for the best weapon in the game. Oh, two fiends. Was that in the game or was that. That was in the chat. It's confusing because some of the enemies in this do make imp noises, which is already weird to hear in Quake. Hi, imp boy. How are you doing today? Or I hope you are well. Both. Both of those things. Oh. The exit is open. Remember the candles? I didn't. Sorry. I don't know what you mean, remember the candles. Showing Skyrim Creation Club stuff. Wait, what? In Doom? Yep. Yippity doo da. Remind us that Quake exists at the mercy of Skyrim. Shard. I'm confused though. Quake exists at the mercy of Skyrim. What is this sentence? I don't know. I hate using hit scan weapons. No, it's okay if I get them, not the enemies. Double standards. They're showing off Skyrim. Where? In Doom? Who are? In this? Where are they showing it off? On stream? What was this? Fart. The School of Dark Magic. Angry Boys. This seems cool. Look at that skybox. Bench health. 
Someone's probably sat on that. Some smelly health. Bonk. Oh, a quake on. Oh, that is going on. We were wondering about that earlier. Why are they showing Skyrim? Show the new one. 